Hello, everybody. It's the coach. This is a special edition of the NFC Championship game on EA Sports. We are moments away from kickoff, and we've got a good one on tap between the Carolina Panthers and the Chicago Bears. I'll join you again at halftime to look at some of these stats and scores from earlier this afternoon. But for now, it's Sunday night football. And on the call, as always, Brandon God and Charles Davis. Now this great venue has hosted some memorable playoff games over the years, and these Bear fans are hoping to make some new memories today at Soldier Field in Chicago. Coming up, it's a battle to represent the NFC in this year's Super Bowl, and we've got a classic in store between the Carolina Panthers and the Chicago Bears. On third down, Trubisky. And the hookup here to Allen Robinson. And he'll be brought down with the first down and a late flag here, too. And he may get a few more tacked on for good measure. A play fake to Montgomery. Now Trubisky. And this is Gabriel on the catch. And he takes this one in for a Bears touchdown. Taylor Gabriel, 27 yards. And they are able to strike first here on their opening drive. Well, we knew they had the crowd on their side. Their defense has already made a stop, and now here's an opening drive touchdown. Yeah. A quick throw out wide, caught by Robinson. And able to get it across the 20. On second down, Montgomery. And he's taken down, but able to slip it. Now it's Trubisky. This is caught by Robinson. And taking it across midfield. And it's... Trubisky now to throw on third down. Finding Gabriel complete. And they're going to have another. Trubisky will throw. He finds Robinson. And down he goes, taking it in seven. Here's second and goal. Now Trubisky. Got his man, and it's caught for a Chicago touchdown. Tariq Cohen there to make the grab as the Bears push further out in front. Well, we know he can run the ball. There he shows he has the ability to do a little bit more. On first and ten, it's Trubisky. Open man, Taylor Gabriel. Now Trubisky to throw. That's complete right side to Gabriel. They'll throw on first down with Trubisky. It's caught. It's Miller. And now Miller hit, and he fumbles. And it's picked up by the Panthers. And he's going to get this one to the 23-yard line. Off the play fake, here's Trubisky. He's going to rifle one deep left side. Got a man. It's caught at the 6-yard line. Trubisky hitting Robinson for a big one, 45 yards. Well, make that now two completions for him on this drive, and these aren't ordinary completions. They're big ones. Yeah, these are the types that make a secondary talk to each other and not in a good way. I say commit to the run and think about it being four down territory. And he's into the end zone. Touchdown, Bears. Taking it in from two yards out as the Bears push further out in front. From the shotgun is Trubisky. And it's a fumble. And the Panthers have recovered. We're going to shut you down. We're going to shut you down. Out of the gun, Trubisky. He's got Burton here. And he'll be taken down, but not. On second and 12, Trubisky. And this is caught. A spectacular one-handed grab there. Now it's Trubisky. Got some real estate inside the 30. It's complete. Now it's Trubisky. He's got his tight end, Burton. And they'll set up a throw. The Panther rush too strong. They get there and take him down. K1 short with a big time sack on third down. It's a loss of seven. down. It's Montgomery. And he'll get this up past the 
From the gun on third down, it's Trubisky. And this is Gabriel on the catch. And they're going to get the first down here. A play fake to Montgomery. Now Trubisky. He'll find Miller. That's complete. Down the numbers. There he goes. Touchdown, Chicago. Anthony Miller, 75 yards as the Bears push further on in front. On this stage, conference championship game, every play is magnified, and that was a big play. No doubt about it. One thing that has these guys a step away from a shot in a big game, their big playability. They can strike from anywhere. The pressure drops off as they look to throw. Nowhere to escape, and he goes down. Khalil Mack with a big-time sack on third down. It's a loss of seven. You never want to give up a sack. From the O-line's perspective, they hate it for several reasons, especially because they felt like they let little brother down back there in the pocket. Oh, no doubt. They have a ton of pride, and they go into every job wanting to keep that guy clean. They want that uniform with no grass stains, no dirt, nothing on it, but it's really, really difficult. You're talking about some terrific athletes who are trying to put him on the ground. Now they go for it on fourth, but this one is going to wind up incomplete. Boy, it looked like he had it and dropped it. And boy, possession here turns over with the football already being in the red zone. So they really needed points here in a two-score game. Could not come away with anything there on fourth. So now Newton and the Panthers down by 12. A minute 53 remaining. Their Super Bowl hopes hanging by a thread as they come up on first down. An incomplete pass leads to second and 10 from the 25. Now here's a throw right side taken in by his tight end. And they'll get it all the way up about five yards shy of midfield. That one a gain of 20 and a first down. And there's a completion to the tight end. And look at the size of these players nowadays. At that spot, 6'4", 6'5", and up. A lot of guys used to be basketball players. Somehow came back to football. That's really good for the game of football. You get better athleticism, great hand-eye coordination. Guys who know how to control their bodies when they run their routes. Now the Panthers going to use the first of their timeouts. Back to throw, Newton. And it's incomplete, broken up. But there is a flag down. Let's see what that's about. Well, the crowd doesn't like that. Was going to bring up fourth. Now it's first. <laughs> they don't like it at all, do they? It brings them back into it, but really not in a positive way. Now they're angry. That can jangle a team a little bit as well. Pass interference ruined that series of downs for them. Newton now to throw. Hartney sold the go route really well. Thought he was going deep, then curled it back inside for a nice completion. DBs love when they pump the brakes, don't they? Yeah, that's really, that's really a whole lot of fun. It's almost like you said, listen, we're going to sell the go. Just go. Well, let's see who's faster. To throw again on second down. Newton looking in zone, but it's incomplete. Curtis Samuel, the one he was looking for. And it's third and short. They tried to throw on second down, unsuccessful. Now it's third and one. To throw is Newton. And Thomas has it. And he's got the first down as he gets it to the eight. Now the Panthers going to signal for their third and final timeout as the clock will stop with an even 20 seconds left to go. Here's Newton. To the goal line, but it's incomplete. Ricky Seals-Jones, the intended receiver, but it'll be second and goal. Again, Newton. That's going to be caught by Samuel. And he will take it across for a Panthers touchdown. A 10-play drive that time. And Carolina scores to cap it off. So with 14 seconds on the clock, they've got to go with the onside kick. And this is going to be recovered by the hands team. 
And that should just about put a camper on this one. And what a ride it has been. NFC champs, they have punched their ticket to the biggest show in sports. And what a way to get there, to go the entire season and then play for the right to go to the Super Bowl and the right to call themselves NFC champs. Elation has to abound. And that'll close the books on the conference championship. For Charles Davis, myself, Brandon Gordon, and our entire crew, we'll talk to you in two weeks from the Super Bowl.